Well, of course, that was the reason I chose him. And, and I believe he's the best of his generation. And, and I got the best of the best together. Christian Bale, Stephen Zahn, Jeremy Davis, you will see the performances later. Did he have any concerns over some of the extreme situations in the script? Well, I asked him right away, would you bite a snake in half? And he said yes. <laughs> and I knew he was, he was going to do it. Actually, later we'll see he was confronting a snake. And he was a, a very, very brave man. I, I really like him for that. He goes through a great deal of physical changes in the film. Yeah, it's true. And in this here, what, what you see here, was shot at the very end of the movie. We had to shoot the film backwards. And, and we'll explain that later on, because he lost so much weight. Losing weight takes you four or five months or so, or six months, and you do it under medical supervision. And uh, gaining it back, uh, you can achieve in about three weeks or so. These so, sequences with the airplanes are done digitally. I was wondering if you could discuss that. Yes, uh, because uh, Sky Raiders are not available anymore, only three or four flight worthy in the world, and they would never allow us to land them on a aircraft carrier. It would be too dangerous, too risky. So in this case, it's pretty much the, the first time in my life I had to use digital effects. Of course, the cockpit is for real. These are digital Sky Raiders. They do not exist anymore. So. I had to do it, and I have no problem with it. Even though I always prefer to do the real thing, and you will see fairly soon uh, when the plane crashes into a rice paddy. This is pretty much for real then. And Dieter's got a small character on the side of his plane. Yeah, it's uh, from a German uh, children's book, uh, Flying Robert, an umbrella and a flying Robert goes out and dares to go out into the storm against the advice of his parents. And the storm takes him away and carries him away and they never find him again. And here you see the umbrella for a moment on the side of his cockpit. Now the sequences of the actual crash appear very realistic. They don't it look is. like digital effects. No, it is not anymore. So this is for real, of course, in the cockpit. This is a digital effect. But the moment the whole thing impacts, there was a huge chunk of fuselage being accelerated and hitting a rice paddy and explosions. And in this case, a stuntman being propelled by an explosion. Here it comes. How now, dangerous was this? Quite dangerous, because explosions are for real. The fuselage is for real the chunks flying around. Actually, the stuntman suffered some burns in his face. And from this moment on, it is Christian again. This moment where the man is propelled by an explosion into the field, into this blast. So from these sequences, now we're in Thailand. Yeah. Why well, did we are in Laos. Well, we shot this in Thailand. Actually, the Burmese border is only a mile uh, into the distance. It's the north uh, westernmost corner of Thailand. And here Dieter finds himself instantly into a situation he's never expected, he's never anticipated. And the world looks...